Okay, upon further inspection, it appears I don't really got to do anything to upgrade it. I just drove it back in and it allowed me to do it. But here are some cool things you can do with it. it looks like there's countermeasures, which sounds pretty cool. So if somebody's locking onto you, you can use one of those. As far as the headlights go, it's pretty standard right here with the Xeon head or the lights. Uh, with the library, you got to do some stuff. You got to do uh, the purchase the research in the bunker property to get the I guess the really cool ones. Otherwise, you get the pretty standard ones where they're camouflage. Um, yeah, you've seen these ones before. I think I'm just gonna go with a pretty standard one. I'm gonna try to make it look pretty ugly, <laughs> to be honest. It's cost 3.8 mil, so I'm gonna make it look like it doesn't cost that much. It's called winter. Let's respray it. I mean, you can do this. You know, you can do chrome. You can do the matte. It's pretty basic stuff. Nothing outside of the ordinary for like color customization. Let's just go with like black. I don't think I'm gonna really. Yeah, it's fine. I want to check out some other things you can do for it. Uh, weapons, yeah, of course. You can put down the explosive um, homing missiles. And the stock machine guns, of course, are always there. Um, yeah, it looks like it had engine tunes. You can get the little new block. Nobody can really see that, but I know it's there, so I'm going to put it on. Engine upgrade, why not? And I couldn't afford any of these, but you know what they are. Flares, self-explanatory, black smoke. And then, of course, different variations of colors for that same smoke. Um, armor upgrade is pretty standard, doesn't make it look any different aesthetically, it'll just improve its uh, uh, armor. So let's go fly it around. I fly it around quite a bit, I already like it better than the original oppressor. So here's the boost, what it looks like for that. Uh, it's way more powerful for one. Uh, here's the missiles, they're just launching away. Um, yeah, and it, it flies very solid. When you go in for a landing, it's pretty solid. Like with the um, old oppressor, it kind of, it doesn't fly like this, it just kind of... It goes off the boost and it kind of levitates almost or hovers for a spit and then it just crashes back down. Because uh, it's a motorcycle. This is actually just a hovercraft. Uh, but I couldn't, I can't figure out how to um, switch my weapons. I tried every little thing. Um, as you can see, I'm just doing smashing buttons. Um, okay, no worries. Well, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Uh, let me know if you bought this thing because you would have to have had to have spent at least about six million. Uh, to get these items so let me know if you're balling like that on gta and how you plan on using your oppressor uh, as always guys thank you so much for watching have a good day